Her eldest child and heir to the throne, Prince Charles, has now become King Charles III with his wife, Camilla, taking on the role of Queen Consort. While the Queen's death means a shuffle in the line of succession, Charles' oldest son, Prince William, is now heir to the throne and William's son, Prince George, is third in line. What does the monarch's death mean for royal family titles? Prince Charles is now King Charles. He will be known as King Charles III, although his full name is Charles Philip Arthur George. At 73, this makes Charles the oldest king to assume the throne. This record was previously held by William IV, who succeeded the throne in 1830 when he was 64. Charles also holds the title of the oldest and longest serving heir apparent to the British throne in history. Camilla, Duchess of Cornwall is now Queen Consort. Earlier this year, the Queen said it was her wish that Camilla Parker Bowles would be known as Queen Consort when Charles became King. In a statement released on 6 February, the day the Queen marked 70 years on the throne, Her Majesty said, and when, in the fullness of time, my son Charles becomes king, first know you will give him and his wife Camilla the same support that you have given me. And it is my sincere wish that, when that time comes, Camilla will be known as Queen Consort as she continues her own loyal service. This marked a change as Camilla was initially meant to be known as Princess Consort. Before his wedding to Camilla in 2005, Charles released a statement which revealed the title she would take after their wedding, as well as the one she will now use as Charles takes the throne. Mrs. Parker Bowles will use the title HRH the Duchess of Cornwall after marriage, the statement read. It is intended that Mrs. Parker Bowles should use the title HRH the Princess Consort when the Prince of Wales accedes to the throne. Traditionally, the wife of a reigning king is given the title of Queen Consort and is crowned and anointed at the coronation ceremony. Unless decided otherwise, a Queen Consort is crowned with the king, in a similar but simpler ceremony. If the new sovereign is a queen, her consort is not crowned or anointed at the coronation ceremony, the royal website reads. Prince William is now the Prince of Wales and the Duke of Cornwall and Cambridge. At age 10, Charles was given the title of Prince of Wales and later had an investiture at Carnarvon Castle in 1969. Today, Charles III passed down the title to his eldest son and heir to make William Prince of Wales. This means William will also likely inherit the Duchy of Cornwall, an estate equating to 150,000 acres and an income estimated to be £20 million per year. Kate Middleton is now the Duchess of Cornwall and Cambridge. The Duchess of Cambridge's title will change to the Duchess of Cornwall and Cambridge, Chris Jackson, PA. Kate Middleton was given the title of Duchess of Cambridge after she married Prince William in 2011 and, because her husband will now be heir apparent, her title will also change. Instead of being the Duchess of Cambridge, she will be known as the Duchess of Cornwall and Cambridge, inheriting the title formerly held by Camilla. But she has also now been given a much more significant title, that of Princess of Wales, previously always associated with Diana, William and Harry's much-loved mother.